Repair Clinic makes fixing things easy. With millions of replacement parts available on our website and the help you need to do the repair yourself. Since we encourage you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. Before you replace the blower assembly in your canopy vent hood, be sure to turn off the power supply to the hood. Place a blanket over the cooktop to protect the surface. Rotate the access panel down. Use a flathead screwdriver to loosen the two screws securing the panel. Fully unthread the screws to release the panel. Remove both grease filters. Use a T10 Torx bit to unthread the screws to release the filter frames. Next, unthread the screws to release the blower assembly cover. Disconnect the blower assembly wire connector. Use a T15 Torx bit to unthread the screws, securing the two upper insulation retaining brackets. Next, unthread the remaining four screws securing the blower assembly. Carefully pull the assembly forward to detach it from the vent hood. Prepare the new blower assembly for installation by cutting the zip tie to release the power supply wires. Insert the tabs on the assembly mounting bracket into the slots in the vent hood and slide the blower assembly back. Thread and tighten the six screws to secure the assembly. Be sure to secure the insulation retaining brackets under the appropriate screws. With the assembly secured, Connect the wire connector. Reposition the blower assembly cover and secure it with the screws. Realign the grease filter frames and rethread the screws to secure. Replace the grease filters. Align the access panel on the hinges, then thread and tighten the two screws to secure. Once the rear of the panel is secured, rotate the panel up and snap it into position. With the repair completed, turn the power supply back on, and the vent hood should be ready for use. 
At Repair Clinic, we make fixing things easy. Thank you for supporting the production of these videos by purchasing your parts from our website.